I'm Old Sneelock. Welcome to another episode of Old Sneelock's Workshop. Today I'm going to show you a few things that I picked up. Well, actually only one thing that I picked up, but some other things that I've had for a while and never really had an explanation of them. These are my cutters for the Stanley number 45. I don't have a full set. All I've got is bits and pieces and I've got a few duplicates like this is a longer version of that or that's a long, shorter version of that. And these appear to be one, two, three, four, five, six, all of the same set. This one came with a plane. This one came with an uh, Stanley number 78. I don't know why they had that in there as a beater, but that's what they did. These don't have the notches. You can see that this one has a notch, that one has a notch. Those are for the current style Stanley 45 that I have. The rest of them are for an older version. And I don't know the exact date on the thing. This one says patented February 23rd, 1886. So I'm thinking this is an older style. This one says Patented 1904. I don't. I don't know exactly what that means, uh, other than maybe it was patented in 1904. Doesn't mean it was made in 1904, but it has a later patent date than the other one. And this one also says patented February 23rd, 1886. So I, I have at least three different sets here, possibly four. This box I picked up today, uh, it was a dollar. Uh, it's not all there, but it's enough of it for me to say, okay, this is what it's supposed to look like and maybe I can finish out what it's supposed to be. Kind of cool, it has the sizes on it. A number 10 is 8th inch, number 11 is 3 16 12 is a quarter. So I don't know what the numbers signify, that the it just looks like they're sequential. But you can also see that these have the notches in them, so they match this series, the ones with the notch. I don't want to carve up these. I can use them in the plane without the notch in them. I just have to take the adjuster screw and, and move it off to the side. What I'd like to do is get a full set of cutters for the one that I have, but I'll just have to wait and see what I come up with in my scrounging around in different places. That's what I picked up today. Not a whole lot, but it's a nice little batch. If you guys have any suggestions for a new video, questions about today's video, or any of the other videos on the channel, just drop a note in the comments below. You know, I read them all. Thanks for watching.